What you need to know about foot and mouth disease. Foot and mouth disease is a very contagious viral disease which affects cows, sheep, goats, pigs and other animals such as antelopes and water buffalo. In some areas, such as southern and east Africa, African buffaloes may be able to transmit the virus to other animals even if they do not show signs of the disease. The disease spreads quickly and causes serious economic losses even if not all animals die from the virus. Highly productive breeds are especially affected and may suffer from the long-lasting effects of the disease. Animals can be infected with FMD multiple times. Humans do not become ill from the disease, but they can play an important role in spreading it to animals through dirty clothes, vehicles and other equipment. The signs of FMD can vary and depend on the species and breed of the animals. In cattle, the disease can be severe and you may notice depression, high fever, decrease in milk production, loss of appetite or difficulty in eating, increased salivation, blisters followed by lesions on the muzzle, inside the mouth, on the feet and teats. Occasionally, it can cause sudden death in young calves. In pigs, the disease can be severe and you may notice an inability to stand, with some animals in a sitting position. Lesions on the feet, sudden death in piglets. In sheep and goats, the disease may not be that evident. However, you may notice small blisters at the coronary band, just above the feet. Sudden death in young sheep and goats. FMD lesions can be very painful in all species and supportive treatment should be provided to minimize animal suffering. FMD virus can be found in all secretions and excretions from infected animals. It can be spread very easily through different ways. The most common is through direct contact between an infected animal and a healthy one. Contaminated materials also contribute to its spread such as hay, feed, water, milk, urine, manure, dirty clothing, footwear or equipment, contaminated pens, buildings or contaminated animal transport vehicles, meat, milk or other products which come from diseased animals, if fed to animals when raw or not thoroughly cooked. Depending on environmental conditions, FMD virus can survive up to 20 weeks on hay, 14 day in dry feces, 39 days in urine and 6 months in slurry. In countries where the disease is endemic, animals should be routinely checked by the veterinary services in key areas where disease transmission is more likely such as livestock markets, dip tanks and slaughterhouses. In the case of an outbreak, relevant tests will be done to confirm the disease. If confirmed, animal movement could be restricted and quarantine measures may be put in place to prevent the disease from spreading to areas where it is not present. There are a few things you can do to help protect your farm and animals. Avoid visiting other farms and sharing farming equipment or pastures with others. Where this may not be possible, clean and disinfect equipment before use. Buy healthy animals and feed only from trusted sources. It is recommended to follow a preventative two-week isolation period when introducing new animals to the herd. Vaccination can be effective to reduce the disease severity and spread. A good quality vaccine that matches the virus and circulation is key for effective vaccination. Your local veterinary authority will be able to advise on the steps to take if you suspect your animals are infected with FMD. By working together and following a few simple measures, we can all contribute to controlling the disease. Thank you for your attention.